when I came on the Oakland Police Department in 79 was you had grandparents taking care of newborn kids because the parents were absent. Now it's the great grandparents trying to do it, they can't do it. So you've lost two generations now to people who, who had kids and then there's no one to raise these kids. And they, you see it in the school system, uh, the police department and the, and the uh, teachers all have the same problem is that you're trying to fix a society that's supposed to be taken care of by the, by the parents. If you don't have parents overseeing their kids, you're going to have crime. And uh, kids probably count for two thirds of all your crime. It'd be burglaries and, and robberies. And to some extent now, we're seeing more violence. And uh, unfortunately, they've come back and uh, worked on uh, this part time contract. Uh, it seems like it's getting worse to me instead of better. I mean, the real downfall of the society that I've seen so far in Oakland is that there's a lack of values. Uh, people being born just don't have the. Uh, uh, upbringing to know right from wrong and as a result we're dealing with consequences and so as you try to increase your your police agencies and your in your um, prison populations you're just treating symptoms you're not treating the problem the problem goes back to uh, having uh, unwanted children how do you teach someone to become a good parent you know I was somewhat I wasn't necessarily anti-abortionist but I didn't really necessarily believe in abortions until I became a police officer but after Seeing what I've seen in this job for the last 30 years, it uh, really makes you think, would I want to be born with some of the conditions some of these kids are born in, under? I wouldn't. I could never have been a single parent, I don't think. Uh, trying to raise my kids uh, by myself, kind of scary thought. Uh, so a lot depends on the person, but a lot of it comes down to your economics. How are you going to pay for it? If you've got two kids to raise, what kind of job do you have? You know, in this case, not too far from where we're sitting right now, I picked up a family back in 83. The, um, Mother had spent all of the uh, uh, AFTC money because grandma had caught a cab and cost about 100 bucks in cab ride. Kids had no food, uh, no nothing. One of the kids found up uh, what had eaten an apple during my shift and part of the apple had gone back behind the back seat and this uh, little uh, three-year-old was, was chewing on the apple because he had nothing to eat. So I finally went down to something to eat. But this, I started seeing this a norm back then where there was just uh, significant child neglect. And it's, uh, it's very unfortunate.